This video is part of a tutorial series on research methods for sport and exercise science and it is brought to you by Edgerton's Garage Gym. What are 95% confidence intervals? Well a confidence interval attempts to make a statement about a population using information from a sample and it provides an expected upper and lower limit for a statistic um, at a specified probability level which is usually 95%. So a 95% confi confidence interval means that for a population that's representative of our sample we would expect a parameter to fall within the stated range 95% of the time. But we can refer to confidence intervals in two ways. We can refer to the confidence interval for the mean and we can refer to the confidence interval for the difference between the two means. Let's take the confidence interval for the mean and if we were to take a sample of international class rowers and measure the one rep max in the back squat for these rows we could construct a 95% confidence interval for the mean in the back squat and if we were to obtain a confidence interval of let's say 115 to 135 kilograms then we would be 95% confident that the actual mean value for squat performance across all international class rowers falls within that range. Now let's look at the confidence interval for the difference between two means and this time we might take a group of international class heavyweight rowers and also look at a group of international class lightweight rowers and we'll measure back squat one rep max performance in both groups. Now we can construct a 95% confidence interval for the difference between the two groups with respect to back squat performance. And if we're to, let's say we obtain a confidence interval of 20 kilograms to 35 kilograms, then that means that 95% of the time, the difference between uh, international class heavyweight rowers and lightweight rowers with respect to back squat performance uh, should fall within that range. If you found this information useful, please like the video. And for more information on research methods for sport and exercise science, please subscribe to Edgerton's Garage Gym.